Hey guys, what's up? <laughs> we landed in Madrid at like 12 and I did not sleep at all. I slept like two hours. We're just pushing through and we got to the Airbnb. It's so, so beautiful. I'm gonna show you guys like a quick tour. We're rushing to head out now to go get something to eat because we're really hungry, but this is our Airbnb. It's so cute. You walk in and it, it has like a loft feel to it. So we've already like laid our stuff out. Um, this is the kitchen here. You walk in and then you see the stairs there. You walk up those stairs and that's our little bedroom there. And then back there's the bathroom. We have a little dining table, super cute. And then this is obviously the best part. That man right there. Yeah, no. <laughs> we have this gorgeous balcony that like, I literally feel like I'm in a movie or something. And this view is right outside of our window. Look how beautiful. It looks fake. We're really excited to be in Madrid. This is my first time. I've been to Barcelona before, but it's my first time in Madrid. So I'm excited to like explore the city. I really, really want to eat some good food. So that's what we're going to go do. I'm going to be taking you guys along like this whole, this whole trip. <laughs> I feel so weird vlogging everybody. <laughs> I have to introduce you. They don't know me. Yes. Well, they're gonna be like some random guy in the back. This is Moody. What's up, guys? <laughs> you have to take over this vlog too. <laughs> so we're gonna go get something to eat, and then we're apparently we're like just we just decided to go to a huge party tonight. It's called an after brunch love party. So I don't know what that means, but we're going, and like it's gonna be. I think there's gonna be like DJs and stuff. So it should be a really big party. I'll probably catch you guys tomorrow because to be honest, I can never vlog like when I'm in a party scene or when I'm drinking and stuff. Hopefully I'll get some clips for you guys. afternoon my beautiful people oh my gosh your girl is struggling right now a mess i am so hung over <laughs> we went out last night we had a great time like it was so much fun the music was good the vibe the crowd like everything was really really fun but we just drank a lot i still feel hungover and it's four o'clock <laughs> but i'm feeling a little better now and we're gonna go walk. We're not gonna waste a whole day. So we're just gonna walk around and then later we are gonna have dinner with uh, one of Moody's friends that lives out here. Just once I eat something, like a real meal, I'll be totally fine. We literally walk out of our apartment, come around the corner and we're here. This is Plaza Mayor. We stayed in the perfect, perfect, perfect location, which I'm really happy about because everything is walking distance. There are like these cute little restaurants, bars. It's just a nice little center to come hang out, get some food, which I desperately need right now. What did you leave? What oh, did I'm cutting you off. Sorry, I'm not used to getting your angle. I don't vlog, guys. That <laughs> does it. Same time. Okay, I need food. Help me. Help. <laughs> We made it to these temples. This is called the Temple de, de Bud. And it was a gift to the Spaniard people from the Egyptians. And me. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, Moody is Egyptian. Yeah, I didn't know that. And it looks really cool. Usually there's like water in this stone area, but I don't know why there's no water now. It looks cooler 
with the water. We're back home. We just spent the day like walking around and doing sightseeing and stuff. Now we're actually getting ready to go to dinner. I am happy to report that I'm feeling much better. I We went and had some empanadas and after I ate that, I felt so, so much better. I was really happy. So yeah, guys, I will catch up with you at dinner. I'm hungry already. I'm always hungry. Say hi to my vlog. dinner and then we went to a bar had a beer but I was just not into drinking today so we ended up coming to the Chocolo chocolateria chocolateria so and this is like sorry <laughs> I keep stepping on his sneak <laughs> you don't do that so we came to this one this is literally around the corner from our house and it's like the most famous like oldest it's supposed to be the best one so we're gonna finally try these. We've been seeing them everywhere. All right, let's see. Try it. <laughs> That's good. I didn't expect it to be so hot. Well, she want another one. Go ahead. <laughs> Good morning! <laughs> Good afternoon. Good afternoon. We have a full day that I'm really excited about. We're going to a bunch of different places. So we've already got. Oh my god! I keep stepping on his sneakers. <sighs> she don't learn. Look at the fit. Okay. It's a little calm fit. It's a little calm. <laughs> but we here. We here to do this. We here to flex. Stay flexing. <laughs> Parque del Retiro and right now we're like in front of this pond that you can take a little boat trip We're not gonna do it, but it's something cool that you can do. We just got in the park So we don't we haven't seen much, but it's supposed to be really nice So I'm excited to see more of it. So we had this guy randomly take a picture of us Paparazzi. Paparazzi. Look at it. I'm international <laughs> And he just gave this to us for free like a guy taking pictures on a really old camera in the park He's like, oh, segundo. <laughs> I keep thinking that he's gonna like come after <laughs> us and like check the and be like, actually, that costs one right. euro. <laughs>
we've got like a 30 minute walk to our next destination, so we decided that we're picking up a bird. came to this rooftop, I got myself a little cappuccino. We came to this place called Circulo de Bellas Artes and um, it's a rooftop and it's beautiful. It's like you can see the whole city of Madrid. And it's just like such a cool chill vibe out here. It's the perfect spot to relax because we've been walking a lot. And it's just really nice here. We're just, I had some coffee and now I'm having a glass of wine. We are now about to enter a place called Tabacelera. It's basically like just a place where you can go and see different art installments. So we're walking in right now. We're gonna check it out. This is our paella. It was cooked in a big pot and they served us here. Good afternoon, Madrid! <laughs> it's our last full day in Madrid. We are gonna go look for some calamari sandwiches because those are supposedly really popular here. Little guy is a little hungry and a little cranky over here. It's a little hungry. Yeah, so we'll check back in, please. When, when we eat. Yeah. We have our beers. And sandwiches. <laughs> 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 Who's in a better mood now? Got some food. <laughs> okay, review on the sandwiches out of 10. 12. 12 out of 10. You're exaggerating. No, they were really, really good, but they were not a 12 out of 10. They were like. Like a nine out of ten. That's a twelve. <laughs> Make sure you grab a beer. You have to grab a beer. If you're gonna have um, calamari sandwiches, you have to have a beer with it. It tastes really good, super refreshing, and it was good. It was delicious. Like the calamari is top quality. Throw some lemon on that bitch. We don't have like such a strict schedule today. Like yesterday, we did a ton of things. Um, but today we're just kind of taking it a little bit more easier and now we're just gonna do a little bit of shopping because we heard that there's like the biggest Primark in the world and we'll probably check out Zara as well. The thing that I love about Madrid is that you can walk everywhere like doing a 25 minute walk here feels like a 10 minute walk anywhere else just because everything is so pretty to look at and like it's just nice to see stuff that way so we've been walking everywhere. We're in Lisbon. After um, our flight, we got here, dropped our bags off, but the Airbnb wasn't quite ready yet, so we had to just leave our bags. We walked around a little bit and got something to eat, 
And then an hour later, we just came back and literally fell asleep. Like I needed a nap so badly, I was so tired. Right now we're heading out for dinner and then we're going on, what is it called? Pub we're going on a pub crawl. So we basically like bought tickets to this like group that does like a bar crawl basically. So we get to join a bunch of people and just like bar hop and like hopefully get a little bit of like the nightlife in. I think it's gonna be really fun. I'm excited. Good morning. I woke up and I'm not hungover. <laughs> So last night we ended up doing that bar crawl that I was telling you guys about and we had a good time It was fun like the, half of it was Kind of like eh. like the first half we went to one bar to take like shots Which were really just a mixed drink <laughs> poured in a shot glass Then we went to this next bar that it was like a club where we had an hour of unlimited drinks um, I'll leave the tour link for you guys in case you want to check it out and then we went to the third place the third place was really fun really nice I think that was my favorite spot like throughout the whole night it wasn't like a huge club but it had they had really good music good crowd like people were like partying a lot and it was just cool like I liked the vibe in there and then finally we ended the night at this beach club it was called urban beach club and it was this huge huge club like right on the beach it was like super packed like oh my gosh this place was packed it was a really dope spot like it looked like basically like almost like a resort like you were on vacation there was a pool in the back um and it was really 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 freaking cool but it was just so packed that like you couldn't even move we didn't really get to like fully enjoy it but i'm glad i went there and saw it because it was like it was really cool to see so that was how we ended our night last night we didn't get too too crazy uh which is good because i feel great right now and i'm ready to have a day exploring different parts of lisbon well, i'm gonna do a redo of the airbnb tour it's a small place but it's really really cute and has a lot of character so when you first walk in this is the living room super super cute this couch is really really comfortable <laughs> like this is how this side of the living room looks and then you have this beautiful balcony right here and then over here we have like a little sitting area and it just like everything looks so beautiful like just shining in the daytime really really nice it's a perfect spot for two people so you go through here and then you have the kitchen very simple it's like a super simple kitchen this is the bedroom our stuff is everywhere but it's really really cute as well and i just love like how this ceiling goes it feels like there's so much character to this place which is really nice over here is the bathroom got a nice shower situation you know what goes everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll also have the Airbnb linked down below if you guys like are looking to stay in Lisbon. This location is so good. Like we're we're less than a 20 minute walk from a lot, a lot of great stuff. So I'll link it down below for you guys. But how cute is my pajama set? It's from Target and it's so soft. I love it. Yours are cuter. Let's see. Got the long johns. <laughs> Get three for ten dollars. Where? I don't know. How you? <laughs> you have to link it. In a minute, you do we're gonna we're gonna link his long johns for you guys. What what's happening over here? Get my stretch over um, Hit tightness for me. Okay. <laughs> you old man. <laughs> <laughs>
the brunch and then came to a place called LX Factory and it's just like this strip with a bunch of restaurants and bars and it's like it's really like artsy and just a good vibe here so we're walking up the strip and just checking some places out probably gonna stop somewhere to have a little drink beginning was a little bumpy but nice little ride. it was so now we are at the timeout market uh, we're gonna get some snacks this place is supposed to be really popular um, for like little bites and things like that so we're gonna head in see how it is oh damn <laughs> Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Another right day, another dollar. Hey, another we. Euro. <laughs> another day, another euro. <laughs> Today we are visiting the Palace of Pena. We came to Sintra, which was like 40 minutes outside of Lisbon. We are walking up the hill to the palace, and it's like a 10 minute hike, but we took an Uber to the bottom of the palace from the train and. Um, it was like such a cute drive. It's like a really adorable little village. Oh, bitch. I can't Go fucking ahead. talk. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited to see, see the castle. We're both not like castle people. <laughs> like we don't typically like to see castles or churches or like palaces, but this one is actually gonna be really cool. Oh wow, you can oh. already see it and it looks so pretty Give just from down peek. here. Little, little sneak, sneak peek. peek. But for now, my ass is climbing this hill. Don't act like you're not out of breath. I'm good, I do this. Yeah, right. <laughs> I, do this. I wake up every day, five in the morning. Yeah. I get a right. five mile ride running. You're lying. And then I head to work. You're such That's a my liar. Daily routine. <laughs> You and win. you would know if you guys followed my vlog, <laughs> but apparently nobody cares about my vlog. Nobody, you don't have a vlog.
I just bet Moody $50 that he can't jump across this plank of wood. <laughs> I don't think he can make it. He really thinks he can make it. <laughs> but I don't know, maybe it's not even that serious. Like it looks, oh my God. <laughs> you see? I need it more. <laughs> I, I knew it. you could. I could do it. <laughs> it's a black ass jump. Exactly. <laughs> I was just testing it. No, you weren't. <laughs> you gave it your all that time. My all? <laughs> you, you and now he's trying to say that this is a little bit of a downhill, so he has a disadvantage to do his like so running it's, jump. It's <laughs> I'm gonna try it that way. <laughs> Come on. Now. <laughs> almost made it. I almost made it. Didn't I tell you? <laughs> <The dance. laughs> didn't I tell you though? Yeah. Like, now imagine. Yeah, but you didn't make it. Now imagine there's a fire and the adrenaline is pumping. <laughs> I'm gonna land here. No, I'm not talking about adrenaline. I'm talking about can your natural body make it? And yes, if I had. It didn't. If I had, listen, fellas. If, we, if you're athletic, you know you cannot jump in these. Oh my god, now it's the sneakers. I was. How far was I? You were like two planks off, exactly. which is exactly what I said. I told him that. Give him my money. <laughs> I told him that I think he could make it like with two planks left. And that's exactly where he made it. We were just being the most shameless like New Yorkers. Like, we don't give a fuck where we're at. We're like, I bet you can't jump that. <laughs> What's your name? I'm George. <laughs> Hi, George. We're in George's tuk tuk. Tuk tuk, not tuk tuk. tuk. tuk, tuk. <laughs> tuk, tuk. It's gonna be fun, okay? It's gonna yeah, be fun. We be doing this. Oh God. 